All right, we were back with some more Pokemon trading card game openings. I was actually not planning on having some more to open before I got my Stellar Crown stuff, but I went to a local card shop, had a pretty decent selection. Prices on these I thought were pretty good. They're all five packs, um, Scarlet Violet era. I made a mistake when I was buying them. I wanted to get one of each starter. I didn't realize that this was cried on until I was checking out. So I will have to go back there to get, look for Maridon since there's a Maridon version of this and then also get Skeledurge since that's our Scarlet and Violet starter. Um, so we're just open up these. We'll start with Cryodon first since he is the odd man out. And um, so let's see. Ooh, I scratched that tin up. Whoops. These are bigger tins than the I've got these black and white ones from the black and white when I was collecting back then. These are bigger. A little bit different shaped, but same idea. Just real quick, flip this over. All these are pretty sure these are exactly the same. So, foil card. This one is Crydon or Maridon EX. This one is obviously Crydon. So our Scarlet Boy. Um, five packs and the TCG. So it's 18 bucks that you saw there, five packs of Scarlet Violet era. I think that is actually pretty good. I looked up the prices of uh, the tins and I think they're, they're, I mean, the prices aren't like crazy cheap, but there was a good selection. Prices were about on par, if not a dollar to cheaper or more expensive. So that's the tax I'll pay for getting it locally. Nice little Cryodon EX promo card. I Didn't we pull like the regular version of that? Put this tin off to the side. You won't be able to see that at all. Let's see, Peldea Evolved, Peldea Evolved, Scarlet Violet, Silver Tempest, and Brilliant Stars. So we got actually two, um, off camera, two uh, Sword and Shield era, and then three Scarlet Violet. So we'll actually just open them up in that order. I can't, I'm pretty sure I've opened up something from every one of the Scarlet and Violet sets except for 151. Um, so I'm pretty sure I have s something from Paldea Evolved and, uh, oh my God. Paldea Evolved and, what's the other one? Scarlet, well, I definitely have stuff from Scarlet and Violet base set. Why uh, do I have, I've opened up dozens of these packs by now and I still, have trouble. All right, let's pop this code card. Got Giraffe Rig, Tropius, Great Ball, Hopip, Gotharita, Honchcrow, Pseudo Wudo, a Hollow Q Font, Q Font, Q Font, Elephant, Reverse Slackoth. And a nice hit. You know, I should let me grab my sleeves. Out of my black and white binder. Or tin, not binder. As we have been doing, anything more than a single star rare gets its nice fit, perfect fit sleeve. A Psychic Dedene. I think that's Electric Fairy. Like in the actual, like actual games, but it's a Terra type, so. Nice card. 
not a secret rare or anything, but an EX, a hit is a hit is a hit. So on to our second Paldea Evolved. That one opened up much easier. Coaxley, Tarkadet, Relor, Tadbulb, Lamigo, Bombardier, Dedendra, uh, Reverse Super Rod, Reverse Braviary Charm, Bravery Charm, Braviary, and then a regular Hollow Tinkaton. Some of these are ringing a bell. Some of these are. Um, and this is our last Scarlet and Violet era pack. Um, some of those are ringing a bell, so I think we have opened up some of Paldea Evolved, but not a lot, maybe? What's the P-A-L? P-A-L. I think I, I have definitely some of that. I haven't fully sorted my cards yet. I'm still working on getting binders and, you know, figuring out how I want to get that set up. Um, but Scarlet Vive Base, we've got Watchful, Kakarok, Mankey. Squawkabilly, Breloom, Kilowattrel, you can evolve it right away. Greedent, Reverse Hollow Mabostiff. Nice art on that one. These, the, I think the dark ones might, the dark or uh, lightning, darkness or lightning might have the best reverse hollows. Clauncher and a Professor's Research full art. And of course, like, is there a, the other professor on these cards? Cause I feel like I've gotten two professors research, like rares like this from different sets. And they've both been Professor Turo. We want the other one. All right, now onto Sword and Shield. One thing about this Sword and Shield packs, which I mean is like these cards, which is, it doesn't, honestly doesn't matter. But um, one thing I like about, this is gonna be really weird, but on the Scarlet and Violet sets, I don't know if it's gonna be able to focus, but the indicator, set indicator is literally just a abbreviation. So this one is like SVI or maybe SVL. While on the Sword and Shield, there's like, and then previous as well, there's these little symbols. I like the just abbreviations because it's just easier to just like look at and be like, okay, this is that set. I don't know the card trick for this. We'll have to remember it for our next Scarlet Vibe, or if we get any more Sword and Shield. Bayhem Reverse and a Keldeo. Non hollow, non hollow rare. So nothing from. Nothing from that pack. Silver Tempest. So that was, let's see, let's check. So four to the front is, four to the front is the sword and shield pack trick. So we will remember that. One, two, three, four to the front. A nice grass energy. Torkoal, Double Turbo Energy, Kindler, Electabuzz, Chimeco, a Gibble. I like, I like the dragon, the dragon uh, like colors and everything. Turtwig, Trap Inch, a Reverse Executor, and a non hollow Rare, Mothim. So, that is our first box we got two hits our first 10 we got two hits the Dene and the professor's research i'll put these off to the side with our promo guy on top so i know who's what and let's do meow scarada next Yeah, Scarada, the grass starter, well, evolved form of the grass starter from Scarlet and Violet. Let's just double check. Yep, one promo card, five packs, and a code card. So yep, looks like these will be the same. And 
Same same old setup. This card was like a little harder to get out. Leave, uh, let me know in the comments if you guys end up buying these tins when they're out. What do you do with them? What do you do with your tins? I kind of use them for bulk storage right now. And then like you saw my black and white one, I have my sleeves and stuff in there. So yeah, Miascarada promo. Got a night, the star, I don't know if you, yeah, if you can see on the camera, the starry, starry pattern for the hollow. All right, so Obsidian Flames, Obsidian Flames, Base Set, Silver Tempest, and Lost Origin. We didn't, it wasn't Lost Origin, right? I don't know. But still, same two, uh, two Scarlet and Violet. Like, of one set and then a base, Silver Tempest. So I actually have a booster box and an ETB coming for Obsidian Flames. And I've already opened a handful of packs for that, so it's supposed to be good. Supposed to be pretty good pulls with the Charizards and all that. Let's do the little card trick here. Boom. Grass Energy. Finizen. Arvesta. Fungus. Pidgey. Belly Bolt. Flamigo. Ronzong. We got a Reverse Paldean Whooper, which I think I have a reverse of this one. Shuckle and rhyme rhyme full art secret this is a secret illustration rare i guess of the set sir or is it a secret art rare i don't know it's a secret because it's 221 of 197 and definitely one i don't have for right now at least so again starting off the tin with a pack that gives a good pull. I guess, from what I've been seeing, Obsidian Flame has decent pulls. But it's like I haven't had the best. All right, bring the energy to the front. And we got our basic rhyme. Rock Rough, Wigglet, Shuckle, Mawile. Is it a metal? Yep. Arvin. Stunfisk. Tessarina. Tessarina. That is a uncommon. And a thunderous. Or, or, I, almost said rever I almost said reverse hollow. Thunderous rare hollow. Which there is a guaranteed hollow in all these scarlet and violet packs. So that's not really surprising. Hopefully our uh, sword and shield packs are uh, a little better. I think those uh, are a bit more expensive. So this these tins are, are probably a good deal because those sword and shield packs are pr probably go for a little more than these scarlet and violet packs. And there's five of them for eight, This was 18 bucks. So Fido de Dene. Oh, we don't, Dene's over there. Got a regular version of him. Beach Court, Sandaconda, Katie. Palmy Reverse, Pawnee Yard Reverse, and Arbeliva, which I think I have. But I will have to see. It might be another set that I have that from. All right. Sword and Shield time. Silver Tempest. Treat us good, Silver Tempest. Treat us good. Is that Reggie Drago? Reggie Drago? Board of the Front. I tell, say, tell it to myself every time so I remember. Energy, Honchcrow, Ninetales, Leafy Camo Poncho. That seems very specific. Ralts, Spinarak, Beldum. I think that's a different art than the Beldum we got before. Maybe that was from a different set. Krogunk, Solosis, Reverse Crocodile, and a Kling Clang. Non hollow, rare Kling Clang. But like I said, I like the reverse hollow darkness, so that's at least something. So far, one hit in this in this partic particular tin, which is 
uh, worse than our Crydon 10. Got four hits. Energy. Galarian Stunfisk. Box of Disaster. Bronzong. Horsey. Mawile. Um, Psychic Mawile. Shellos. Binnacle. Porygon. Ducklet. And a Giratina V-Star. That is not a secret. But it is a hit. I don't know where this ranks in this set. Because I... One, have a bad memory. And two, um... I haven't really looked into the Sword and Shield stuff since it is typically more expensive than uh, Scarlet and Violet since it is older. We have a nice Giratina V-Star. Dragon type uses grass and uh, psychic energy. I said electric. So yeah, two hits out of this tin. Uh, I think it's probably better than that other one. The Dene and then the Professor's Research as the hits versus a Full art, I guess full art trainer than a Pokemon, but this is a V star versus a uh, versus an EX, so even Stevens maybe. And lastly, Quas 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 Quackovil Quackovil Quack Quackovil. I don't know how to say the name. Quackovil. Let's see if this is the same pack selection, maybe. So the the Meowskarada tin had still the same like two Sword and Shield, three Scarlet and Violet lineup, but it was a different lineup than Meowskarada. Again, let's take a look at our star of the show. Quavel, Quavel, two energy. 230 damage. Put two energy attached to Pokemon into your hand. I mean, like, you can't do it every turn, but that's ridiculous, man. 230? For two energy. All right. So we got some more Obsidian Flames, Obsidian Flames, Scarlet Violet, Silver Tempest, Lost Origin. So this is the same pack selection as Meowskarada. Um... Slightly, I think slightly different, which would make sense because Obsidian Flames was maybe the newest set when the this tin came out versus whatever we got two of in that first pack, which I honestly can't remember because my memory is shot. All the years of playing video games through my memory. All right, bring the energy to the front. Basic Fire, Larvitar, Cleffa, Inke, Toad School, Camerupt, Lapras, Masquerain, a Reverse Belly Bolt, Senesti, and an Absol, which I think is actually a repeat. But for now, it is double rare. Double star rare. It gets a sleeve. I believe this is one of the ones I pulled in a previous pack in a previous video but it is bound to happen but a hit is a hit is a hit that's one for Quavel already similar to how Cryodon started with that one hit code and energy to the front water Brokey there they go together found sweet ball picks phantom king gambit okolonge Letter of Encouragement, a Reverse Charmander, which I think is new for me, Kangaskhan, and a Gita, Gita, sorry, Gita Trainer, Rare Trainers, I feel like that's not super common, like you do like special illustrations and stuff like that, but like just a straight up Rare Hollow Trainer, I don't think that's super common, Gyarados, Scarlet and Violet, Terra and up, Terra and up water type. So now it's only two two times weak to electric as opposed to four, which is handy. Basic energy, Pineco, Flitzel, Quicoco, Drowsy, Staraptor, Electric Generator, Wugtrio, 
Why does Wug Trio turn from white to pink when it evolves? Indeedy, Wiglet, and a Reverum. Reverse Wiglet right into our Doug Trio or Wug Trio there. Just a regular hollow there from Scarlet Glot Base. So then we got our Silver Tempest and then a Lost Origin. Uh, one thing that they had at this shop, um, they had a, like a bunch of boxes, which I grabbed uh, a couple boxes from them. Um, but they had a bunch of boxes. One, two, three, four. I got a nice V-Star card. Um, they had a bunch of boxes that were like a good price, 15 bucks. Um, but they also had, um, where was I even going with this? Honestly, I went right out of my mind. They had a good selection of like boxes, older and like, by older I mean Sword and Shield, which I've got one, which you'll see later. And then uh, some tins, some build and battle sets, which I thought about picking up because they were like 10 bucks, I want to say. That's, there's four packs in there. Um, they had some 151 stuff, but it was a little too pricey for what it was, it was the poster collection. It was the binder collection i probably would have picked it up because the binder seems nice and it's cool but yeah i'll be going back there for sure they have a really good selection and pretty decent prices got a restart card altaria lance flushender emolga meditite durant ralts litten or versus pharaoh seed and a hollow rapidash i think that is our first Hollow card from our Sword and Shield packs. Oh no, we got we got that Giratina. But I guess our that's our first like rare, regular rare hollow. The the other ones were just uh non hollow rares. I don't honestly maybe one day I'll get better at opening these packs. Alright, our last Our last pack from these tins. Not the last pack for me today. Not the last pack for you for videos. But last pack from these tins. Energy. Relicanth. Lost Vacuum. Gastrodon. That's I how in the art it's like has them both both versions. Snover Jinx. Inkay. Squovit. Phalanx. A Malamar reverse. And a regular Snorlax. Well, not a regular Snorlax. It's a hollow. But a regular rare Snorlax. Unfazed Fat. Prevent all effects of attacks done to your opponent's Pokemon. Or from your opponent's Pokemon done to this Pokemon. Damage does not affect. Well, I think it is. So, our one hit from this tin. This is our worst... Worst hitter of the bunch, Quavel. Absol EX, which I think is a repeat. So I mean, overall, overall, let's uh, pull out our our hits here. And I'll just put that off to the side. Pick all that up, see what we got out of our tins here. I was really, I really wish I would have gotten the Skeledurge instead of the Cryodon just because I was doing it for a reason, being like each of the tins with the starters. But then I didn't realize until as I was checking out. Mm, that's that. I didn't realize until as I was checking out that it was this, the cried on one. So I guess that gives me an excuse to have to go back, you know? All right. So let's flop these, flip flop those around. From our Quavel box, we've got our EX from Obsidian Flames, Absol EX from Masquerada. We got our Rhyme from Obsidian Flame. And then I think this is Lost Origin. And then Crydon, we got our Dedenne from. Paldea Evolved. I think that was the one we had the two packs of. And then Scarlet Violet Base Set for our Professor's Research. 
three tins, five hits, 15 packs, one out of three. Not, I mean, not, I don't think, I don't know if any of these are like particularly crazy. If they were, it'd probably be one of these three. These are like, you know, I see secret full art stuff. This is just like, might be a useful Pokemon. I don't know. But I think that's a, it's still a decent, decent, uh, decent variety of packs, decent uh, price for those. So I'll definitely be going back to get more to at least cl uh, complete the two different tin sets. And I'll have way more tins than I know what to do with. So again, let me know in the comments. What do you do with your tins? And also, what do you do with your energy? Every pack comes with one. Once you complete, once you have like a complete set of energy, what do you do with it? I guess if you play, if you play, you probably buying ETBs or building battles or something that already come with energy. So I don't know, just let me know what you do with that. So yeah, keep an eye on the channel. We've got more Pokemon stuff coming and I hope you had a good time. I'll see you next time. Peace.